So Ray Cleanly here and going to the front earlier, Tennessee of Glenn Huntley. As we look closely tucked in behind. Ryan Geard from Essen and Tom Forthorpe there are now starting to move around as he's gained momentum. Richard Coleman, the Paralympian, in his wheelchair. So down the home straight for the first time to collect three laps remaining. It's Hennessy, Forthorpe Geard, they're the leading trio back to Aspinall, the Sandringham athlete which is Jonathan Matthews also up there early. Fellow St. Stephen's athlete Kevin Craigie and starting to move forward in the Knox outfit round the shoulder of the Sandringham, Jonathan Matthews. That's Benjamin Tooney. So through the line to collect two laps remaining, the wheelchair competitor Richard Coleman of Athletics Chilwell. As we look down the home stretch now to come through to collect 800 metres remaining, still Hennessy, who went to the front very early. Tom Forthorpe from Ringwood there too, Ryan Geard, Lachlan Aspinall and Ben Toomey there, your top five on the track. Leading that next group of athletes is the Sandingham runner there, Jonathan Matthews. So through 700 metres, 146 on the clock there for the leading Runner there, Luke Hennessy, who's just started to extend a slight advantage over Forthorpe, back to Gaird, Aspinall and Toomey there, your top five still. Matthews leading the chase there for Sandingham. As we turn our attention to the front straight again, it's Richard Coleman, who'll come through to collect the bell with 400 metres remaining. Can I ask the Place getters in the women's open and under 20 walks to come to presentation, please. Place getters in the women's under open and under 20 walk to presentation, please. So coming down to collect the bell now, Ryan Geard from Athletics Essen and has gone to the front and starting to set the tempo for Thorpe and Toomey as well as Aspinall there in the top four. Hennessy has stepped off the track it would appear, so out in front collecting the bell, geared to me, Forthorpe and Aspinall at the front. And with 300 metres remaining, the pace still continuing to thicken, Ryan geared, Tom Forthorpe and Ben Toomey have now broken away from Aspinall and starting to fade, Jonathan Matthews from Sandringham starting to move through now. And across the line there, the wheelchair competitor in the Prox 319 was Richard Coleman. As we turn our attention back to less than 200 metres remaining, it's Forthorpe that's gone to the front now and kicks strongly. Toomey hanging on to his tail as geared. Matthews from Sandingham really starting to wind home now, has overtaken geared and Aspinall and moved into third. But the run runners with less than 80 metres remaining, Toomey's gone to the shoulder of Forthorpe and gone past. But Forthorpe fighting on on the inside and coming back through Toomey now. Toomey seems to be struggling and Forthorpe's power through and will take the win, 350-38 in front of Ben Toomey from Knox, a bolting third place there from Jonathan Matthews from Sandingham. Ryan Geard will cross fourth.